Welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 Long War 2. This will be Operation Knife Hand. And we have to recover an item from the Advent Train and attack Advent Counter Insurgency Ops, which means we will do a major breakthrough. We got a squad of seven people, a fairly, you know, fairly um decked out, but you know, a skillful bunch. So we'll be looking forward to doing this mission. Enemy readiness is vulnerable and current enemy activity is very light, so no doubt this will be a fairly approachable, fairly straightforward mission, and I'm certainly hoping it will be a relatively short episode today compared to the long ones we've had over the past couple of days. So, um, Small Town the Advent Patrol 17, outskirts of Mumbai, so yeah, we're still pretty much in India. One thing I need to do is definitely set up the number of people on Intel in neighboring countries so that we can actually sort of do more important missions there as well while we kind of just wait until we get laser weapons. Once we hit laser weapons, we have we have um, a good team of five people, then we'll go and hijack the Advent Tower. And that's pretty much the plan for the time being because it's basically, um, I'm basically thinking of um, what they call a timing attack in StarCraft 2 or basically in any kind of um, RTS, real-time strategy games, in that probably we'll wait for them to talk first. No talking? Okay. Menace one five. There we go. We've got a bead on the advent data vault near your position. Be advised, self-detonating charges are in place at the target. Move to disarm and extract the package before its contents are destroyed. I've okay. got enemy movement here. That's interesting. We've got company there already, and that looks like to be two pods already. So, which is kind of annoying. So, uh, we will set ourselves up for an attack. And then just see how far the container is, not that far, and we've got a specialist this time around, so we can definitely um, hack it when we need to. So for now, we just gotta get people into position, and um, you know, ready. <laughs> uh, okay, so we have a sniper. Position. And of course, thank goodness for the stock, we can steady weapon. Uh, Jayburn, what can we do with you? Uh, you're, uh, yeah, you're a specialist, so that's great. Um, not really much in the way of this wall cover, so I'm gonna be a bit careful. There now. But otherwise, we still have to push oh, forward it. and um. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Got it covered. Okay, and Cynthia, you've got a shotgun, so I definitely want you I'll to be move. up front. And no, oh, like oh, we've got we've got the uh, we've got good old Lexi. So Lexi will be able confirmed. to. Actually, that... Okay, so we've got a good eye on where everyone is. So we'll see how they move, and then that will decide where... what we do from there on. But basically the main idea with um, laser weapons is that... Uh, oh, okay. That could be... Okay. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna pull Lexi back and then we're gonna engage this group. And then the Vipers will probably come next turn. Okay, so they move like well everyone's moved like further away than I expected, which is kind of kind of annoying, but so but first things first we wanna move Lexi away from them. We just wanna make sure we the Vipers can't see us. Okay, so we can't see the Vipers anymore, that means we can initiate on these guys. So we've got a steady weapon. Now that's a pretty good shot, so I feel like we should set up an overwatch trap. So the quest so obviously what we need to do now is get a bunch of people get a bunch of people ready. <laughs> that's affirmative. Um and I know I keep meaning to say the thing about laser weapons and I just keep I just keep getting distracted by needing to dis needing to strategize. Which is, you know, for, I guess most people is understandable. Uh, you... You are not in the most, uh, interesting of places at the moment. Good copy. Moving on target. Cause, cause the other thing is that I want the... Yeah, I want Chiyoko over here. There now. Overwatch. Okay, so we'll take the shot. And then this guy is... We'll have him use a grenade. And then we'll 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 suss out what to do with the rest. Jack, take a shot, kill him. That's gotta hurt, especially when he when we did nine damage to a guy with three HP. Okay. 
Great! That's exactly expected. Okay, um, now... What you can do is throw a grenade in there, or you can throw a grenade over there. The problem, the problem is it's going to be tough to get you to move closer, unless... Um, we still want to keep our shinobis in concealment, so we'll definitely take advantage of that. I guess the other thing I could do with Ho is that I could... Actually, no, because once he throws a grenade, um, he will be in... Um, so you can only see that guy. Okay, so Ho can only see that guy. Cynthia... The problem is, I know if I move up here, the Vipers may see us. So, the, the... So, the tricky thing is that, do I move up here? Um... I know when Lexi was there, she could see the Vipers, but I don't know if I move closer here, whether I'll see the Vipers or not, so... The other, the other thing as well is that, um... Can I... Actually, no, this is almost a possibility, but probably probably not too plausible. Um, if you say so. Okay, let's take this guy out with a grenade. Jennifer, I kind of want you to kind of just like maybe sneak up, but the problem is there could be like another mob right around that point, so that's something I don't want to risk right now. The, the other thing is that we know the Vipers are over there, so... We, we have to move Ho somewhere where the Vipers can't see him. If I move him here, he can see around that edge, but if, if, I, if I move him here, what will happen? Okay, that's fine. So I don't know where the Vipers will go next, um, so we just got to be careful on that front. Um, okay, so... I guess Lexi can go... I guess Jennifer can go up and get an eye on them. Moving out. That'll give us a better idea. Okay, so they're still over there. So if they move that way, then they're, they're going to spot Ho, which is not going to be great. But we can at least get Cynthia close on. And definitely Lexi and I will watch. May as well get a free shot in while we can, but uh, oh, that's probably not going to happen. Okay, so they moved over to the side, which is interesting. Uh, I guess what I can do is that I can leave Jennifer there to scout them out, and we, we just go, we just go, go all the way to, we just go straight to the data cache. So I think we can definitely do that. Because that will, that, will, that will give us a better idea. Because they, they, they don't seem to be on alert. So that's not something I'm worried about for the time being. So I want to keep Jennifer and Lexi close to them. So we... And then and then, um, and then sort of like everyone else will sort of keep moving Absolutely. towards the right. So Jack... I feel like... I feel like... Probably a good idea if I get you the steady weapon. The problem is they might move again, which might render Jack a bit useless. Understood. Moving out. But we'll, we'll see what happens. And then Cynthia, let's. Okay, so I can't move Cynthia that way. Otherwise, they'll see they'll see through the windows. So heading to that location. Okay, don't don't see a don't see a squad. So, gotta be careful there. Got it covered. Ho, you're in uh definitely wanna pull you back. But definitely not in uh a... See if I move you here they'll they'll see you. The the other thing is that they could they could probably see you as well. So I'll pull you back which way? If you move here they'll see you, so I think I'll Pull you. Just want to make sure that the vipers can't see okay, him wherever he moves. So. But we still want to keep keep a good eye on them. I'm going. Affirmative, covering now. Um. All right. So this is fine. Um. I guess the question is how how close can we get Jennifer? 
Moving to designated coordinates. On Overwatch. And Spider. Good tree. Let's get you up there with the rest. Good to go. To the data cache. Actually, I, I it just occurred to me I should have her go to the data cache. Oh, yep, there we go. Not even close. Well, that's expected, and not gonna be that much of a Okay, got a hit, that's great. Um, this is, this is rocket, this is, oh, that's gonna hurt. This, this is, this is literally prime time for a rocket. So, we'll definitely take advantage of that. Um, thank goodness for steady weapon, looks like you've got a good hit on a bunch of people. Um, so, Lexi, what will you do? You... Yep, this is good for a rocket. Be silly to not take such an opportunity. Okay. Uh, 85, 85, 38. Now, do we have a. No, Gertrude should have lightning reflexes. But, and um, I, I guess it doesn't really feel like it's worth it just to make a run. So it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't really feel like like it's worth it. Sure thing. Oh, you can't see anything. That sucks. Well, ho. Could you? Can you? The, the problem is, is that Viper, I don't know don't know what to do about that Viper, so I think I'm gonna get Gertrude to run, to run and gun, and then she'll, she'll blast, she'll blast someone off. So, go! Oh, that's a close, 34 even with lightning reflexes, that's amazing. Alright, 83, 73, 69, so kill the 83. I definitely got that one. What happened to the sniper's target though? Okay, that was very strange. Please kill this sniper. That's our boy Jack. Alright, um, we've got a flash A. Five to seven. It, um, the problem with, with it being five to seven is that obviously I don't know whether it will actually hit or not. So, so I'm gonna soften her up with her. So with her, if I kill a civilian, it's like why? Why do you do this to me? Why? Poor guy. Alright, and then... Do we have to reveal the shinobi? I guess we have to. Um, Cynthia, you're, you're just gonna stay and watch over there. And Jennifer... You know what, you... actually... You can grab that loot first. Out. Except that now you're flamed. Well, not that, not that, that big of a Got deal. Uh, you can still flash her, right? 92. Yep, that's pretty good. The only, I mean, I, I suppose I should have, I should have technically thrown the grenade. Got it. <laughs> um, but Not a because if she had missed the, if, if if she had missed the sword slash, then obviously that would not have turned out so well. All right, now it's time to get people moving. Uh, we'll get Jack Ryan a bit closer to the area of interest. Um, we will get Chiyoko up here to take advantage of. You know, some event scouting, of course. Ho, oh, we're gonna get you further up this way, so you can be the one to open the cache. Uh, Cynthia? Yeah. Moving. You haven't been doing much. But we want to keep it nice and simple. For now. Uh, Lexi, Lexi. Why is your, why is your call name Hijack when you are technical? That doesn't make a lot of sense. Alright, Jennifer, let's get you all the way back here. Okay, I'll go. Same for you, Gertrude. Objective sighted. 
Menace 1 5, this is Avenger. We have positive confirmation of the target package. Move to acquire. Uh, just in case, should we call? We should. How long does it take? Four turns, we should probably call it. The panic is not necessary. Okay, um, I think we're doing pretty well for now, so. We still want to suss out the area at least. So, ho, ho, ho. If you say so. Can you? You cannot. That's an interesting one. Moving out. I'll get some. I'm on it. Jack, let's go, get go, you up go. here as well. Ho. Hi, Jack. See. Moving to Overwatch. I know, this is boring, but... Affirmative. What else is there to expect? I suppose there is a flip side to the missions being too easy. So... But I shouldn't really complain be because... Okay. They will undoubtedly get harder in future. Scanning. Oh, that means something. Okay. That's my Chiyoko. Shot wide. Okay, that's that's not too bad. We've got an overwatch. Um you can hit a tank or something. Okay, so that is apparently a fuel tank over there. Interesting. Okay, well, uh Chiyoko's got Chiyoko can definitely take a bunch of shots. So it's a pity we don't have a grenadier, Sapper would be really great. Well, uh, we, we won't complain too much, so firstly we'll get Gertrude to run the overwatch. What's over there? Over Take advantage of lightning reflexes. Oh, minus 20%. Maybe maybe the other one was minus um, something as well, so... Yeah, so maybe it wasn't, wasn't that, maybe it wasn't that terrible. Alright, um, Ho, where, uh... This guy's gonna be a problem, so let's see who we who we can smack with Gertrude first. Oh, these aims are terrible. Okay, how are we gonna do this? Uh 48, 48. Let's see if we can take out the sentry. Okay, Grace, that's not the greatest. Um And I need to equip you with a free free low so so we don't have this kind of um shenanigans. Um, can I throw it? No. Good to go. 37, 30, no, that's, those are all terrible. This is gonna take me, this, this is gonna be something. Alright, where can I move? Go. Over here. Gertrude's probably gonna have to throw a flashbang, but of course we just wanna see who we can take out, who we can take out first. Jack, and there's Ho. But Ho does not have any grenades. Whatever you say. Alright, easy on the attitude, Lexi. You can take it out this guy. Me, <laughs> that's got a sting. Um oh you can you can chop him down. So, uh, oh, yeah, that would be good. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, you, you had the bonus to hit, so that makes it really, really useful. Ouch, poor guy. It's done for two turns, that's fine. We go for a slash. We can always slash him again. That's not a good way to go out. <laughs> First you get stunned, and then you get chopped by a knife. And then you get chopped. Then you get stunned, then you get chopped. Alright, uh, Ho, can you hack the chest from there? No, you cannot. That is annoying. Oh? No, you sh Oh! Crap! I completely forgot there was one more guy over there. 
Well, no, not much we can do. Just take a shot and probably oh, should have moved up and taken a sm down a smoke grenade, but oh well. I'm all right. The cavalry's here. Indeed. Well, Po, can you please see the cash? Excellent. Please do so. Alright, uh, one new rebel joins the Haven in this region. So soldiers hack his stat permanently increased by 10. Oh, I want this. 1 in 4, uh, well, that was expected. I mean, but I mean, a permanent hacking stack increase is definitely very invaluable. So I'm just thought, okay, you know what? It's free, may as well grab the opportunity while we can. Alright, so we got reinforcements incoming. We got one more turn. And you should be able to throw at least a grenade just to. Keep that guy busy. I don't want to flash because he's way too far. Um, and you, yeah, you can't. Sh <laughs> oh, lovely. Um, okay. Now I just need to move people into reasonable cover, and then we'll we'll do a mass overwatch, and then and then we'll be back. Alright. Fire in the hole. It's probably not gonna kill him. Oh he did. That's pretty cool. Alright, um Overwatch. Overwatch. Do all the overwatches. Uh Cynthia, let's get you in a safer spot. Okay. Because I don't know where they're gonna land. And you can steady whip. No, actually, you can throw a smoke grenade on on um. Open smoke. No smoke grenade on Ho, because he's the he's the one with he's the one with all the cash and stuff. So we definitely don't want him Reloaded. being hurt. Got it and all that and all that jazz. I'm trusting you here. I'm on it. That here. Oh, there they are. Oh, hello. What's this guy? Guys are terrible shots. Not good. We got a new type of viper here. Need to be on the panicking guys. This is firebrand. It's time to go. Indeed, the vipers have been fun. Heading out. Confirm. No problem, boss. Got you it. should be able to. I guess that'll be okay. Start the whole team. Just in time. Goodbye, Edvin. It's been fun. Avengers, this is Firebrand. Package is secure. All surviving XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand returning to base. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. That was an interesting arm, um, that Viper. Hmm. Definitely means they're advancing, so we definitely need to be able to keep, uh, you know, keep up with them. So. But at least we're doing well. We got everyone in and out alive, and um, I don't think there was really any major mistakes apart from not recognizing there was a fourth guy in that very last, not in that second last mob. So yeah, pretty 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 satisfying mission. Not really much else to say about that. So I'm trying to think. So I'm trying to recall what we have to do next, and I'm just thinking. Okay, it might be about time to get. To actually, well, firstly, we will need to stock up on some supplies and um, some because when laser weapons finish the research, you are gonna want to build a bunch of them. So, and um, so we should stockpile a bunch of supplies for that. But first, let's let's deal with the promotion. So, um, all right. So this will be our first medical. Uh, um, our first medic, first medic guy. Don't know if it's a good idea. It's um, it's definitely something I'm still urring on because it's like it's one of those. What well, do do we really need to heal people first? Which is which is kind of the question I'm asking them. So healing actually be mainly gremlin heal and gremlin stabilize. Gremlin has a single charge, but mech is equipped. The gremlin will gain an additional charge. I think. I, um, I think the stabilize will at least be 
handy. It's just one of those things where if we can avoid it happening, then it's going to end up being useless. Alright, so Jack Ryan, damn good ground with, with death on above. It's going to be it's going to be a good um, good, it's going to be a good way to really just kind of get things going. So aim 68, that's not great. Um, I'm very tempted to do slug shot. The, and I guess the question is, with, uh, well, she's got 16 mobility and low aim, so part of me is thinking she could take the lightning reflex, or she could take the electro shock, because then, um, because even with even with crappy aim, she will at least disarm in the target because like she's gonna miss anyway, <laughs> which is probably not the best way to think about it. Um, okay, so so this is gonna so this is a combat shinobi where she's gonna kind of just be up in up in front. So we're gonna go for inviter here. And moving on. Suppressor stock advance, laser sight, critical hit, hit the tans, and crit sight of each by two. rapidly develop and deploy advanced new technologies, any recruits you encounter with a proclivity towards the sciences would be of great use to me. We'll, we'll get there. <laughs> get some training, even though it's, it's actually a training a skill called get some, which is... Uh, oh well. Okay, so you've got 68, which means... You're not going to be that great. Uh, activate this ability, throwing or launching a support grenade, and the throw will not cost an action. Oh, um, I guess the question is, do I want a support grenade, grenadier? And if I do, why do I want a support grenadier? So that's just um, that's just a tricky thing because it doesn't really feel like I need support at the moment, but it feels like something that I should at least keep in the back of my head. So. Um, that's gonna be a tricky one. Um, I mean, I still love Sapper. It's nice to be able to destroy cover, destroy buildings, that sort of thing. And the the other thing is that since you since you essentially have a limited number of grenades, it, it doesn't feel like it's right to um, how to say it, like throw do two grenades in a single turn unless you're really really desperate. So it's a tricky one. Um, so we go for so we go for the standard Sapper heady ordinance because. I mean, their versatility can really can't be undermined. So, all right. So, um, so we got power rate right there. We got sixty-one supplies. Uh, what I wonder, a resistance com in here, which is one twenty-five supplies. So, which will hopefully get up quick, closer to once we build the alien machinery. Okay, supply drop. Yes, let's do that. Oh, jeez. Okay, carry on. Event. Oh, we've got advanced training. So, let's see who we can train next. What can Gertrude train when using guns? Oh, oh, some of them are pretty good, but we gotta, um, I don't know, we could, we, we could just really pick a whole bunch of people, I guess. What could, what does she have to get? Oh, she, once, once permission by a pistol shot, I cannot miss. Or she could gain plus one mobility. That would be pretty useful, actually. Um, let's just see. Okay, let, let's look at it in terms of classes and what we have. So if like if we have more than one one type of class available, then we'll at least train one of them. So Chiyoko's got 14 mobility. So bumping up to 15, that would definitely be useful. Alright, so... Uh, of course, what, it's not great to have Chiyoko off, off our team for a bit, but I don't think that's going to be too much of an issue. Alright, 3, 2, 1, thank you. Accept. New staff available. It, um, okay, the question is, do we... Is well what, what's going... Commander. What's going on with our research at the moment? Do we actually need more scientists? Combat armor. Uh, uh, robotics or the autopsy. Um, doesn't look like we need extra scientists Without at the moment, so I'm not going to... fossil fuels, power is difficult to come by outside the cities. Even among the staunchest of anti-alien dissidents, Recovered advent equipment is highly shut up, Tygen. Resistance communications facility construction initiated. So that's one there, and then uh, we we'll still keep clearing alien debris, and then um, hopefully we can stockpile some supplies for laser weapons. Um, let's let's go finish making contact, and then and then we will head to the black market. Your room, thank you. Let's um let's finish building that resistance column. Thank you. And then we'll put the we'll put the other two to mine out this alien debris. In here and Sarah. Get, get to work please. Fifteen days, that's not too bad actually. 
So we'll be able to build a workshop there and then that will make things a bit a bit more a bit easier for us. So finish that. Excellent. New regional contact located. That's great. So for here we uh supply yeah, let, let's just leave it on the default. And then um because it's it's like we kinda need a balanced bunch of people at the moment. Wow, she's got a lot. <laughs> oh. Okay, so then that's two in hiding, so let's get a couple of people in Intel. And that should make things a bit easier. Of course we want high Intel once we want to try and liberate the mission, so that's definitely something we we'll wanna keep in mind. Let's head to the black market. See if we can pick up uh maybe another engineer? Okay, so scientist, engineer, or gunner, or oh, 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 some of some of this stuff is good. Um, improve aiming combat regardless of the weapon of choice. That's gonna be pretty useful as well. Um, and one Illyrium core. This this is really it's kind of a tricky thing because it's like how how much do I value you know certain people over others? Um, I can get. I can get an engineer and I can get a gunner, but that will use up all my supplies. So I, I need to double check my inventory. Uh, engineering, build inventory. Um, to be aside of Why am I checking my inventory? I wonder if this is what it was like remember. in the old days. Always on edge, ready for a fight on a moment's notice. Certainly keeps you on your toes. Hey, Commander. This is interesting. I didn't know we could build a bunch of PCSs. Oh, so that's why I want to check my in inventory. I want to see how many al alloys and... Uh, don't have any alloys, apparently? That's interesting. Uh, or maybe maybe that's meant to be our... Research is proceeding as planned, Commander. What can I do for you, Commander? Well, let's um, let's uh, I I completely forgot about these. We could uh, basically seem to push the update effects. That's all to resist panic, panic and psionic attacks. Okay. Um, before we can, we need to have the GTS online before we plug this into the troops. Uh, we need to install the soldier will not take a watch shot at the less than the minimum of seventy five percent to hit. That's an interesting one. I mean, I'm not sure why it would be useful. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna have to think about that one for a bit. Um, nanoscale vest, I completely forgot about this as well. But the problem is they all use supplies, and it's like I, w I want to save supplies. But it's like if, if we invest in an engineer gunner now, then it means that we'll, we'll probably have some kind of advantage later. So, I'm gonna... Hmm, tricky. I'm gonna grab the gunner. And we, and I think, I think we're better off just saving, sa saving up so that we can spend stuff on laser weapons when we can get it later. So, all right. So, uh, don't remember. Oh, that's right. We like we need to save a bunch of stuff for other things. So, superior side, we're definitely selling. Um, stock is expand amazing advanced suppressor. No, that's pretty useful. We'll keep that. We've got twenty-five alloys, eleven crystals. So I think that's actually we don't need to buy any. That's definitely a given. And while while we saw the PCS we met, we can grab a scientist or we grab an engineer. I'm gonna go for the engineer. Because um because then that will that will make things that will we'll be able to mine stuff quicker and um it'll it'll make it'll make stuff a bit easier for us to deal with. So alien debris, I suppose we don't we we don't need the alien crystal, so we should clear the debris. And then um and then and then it's just like Basically, if we get the engineer now, we don't have to worry about the engineer later. Okay, so we got our gunner. I want to see how much how, how much aim she has. Sarah Giggle Schneider works for me. Seventy six aim. So um the the oh, yes, thank you, thank you. Um, so 70, 76 aim is really really good. So the the other thing is that we hail of bullets. Um. What am I trying to think? What, what am I thinking? I mean, the thing is, is uh, there's sort of there's so, there's there's few ways you can look at it. You, you can get hell of bullets because it's essentially guaranteed damage. But my my reasoning is that if you if for gunners with low aim, then with low aim you take hell of bullets so that they have a chance to get guaranteed damage. Whereas the gunners with high aim are more likely going to be able to hit anyway. So I think I'm going to stick to that logic. 
and used her as a as a as a, an offensive gunner while she got high aim. So we'll go for center mass and shredder. That that will make her pretty versatile out on the field, and um, hopefully hopefully an asset to our team. All right, what do we do now? We can we can still aim for the network tower, but like I said before, I want to do that. Want to do that when we get laser weapons. So um have these guys on supply well actually you know you what uh, oh, you know you guys have some pretty good moves there setting course for the indian regional zone let's pass some time for a bit and then uh hopefully the research will be done in four days okay all right so great uh carry on so who else can be trained now Okay, so class, tree assaults, and obviously we want to try and train the people that are higher up, so just trying to think about who, gonna, yeah, mobility is always great. Actually, how much is the upgrade? 100 surprise, and, uh, and, and we need a gunnery sergeant rank, so that's not going to happen. <laughs> Alright, let's keep scanning, officer training, great. Uh, so that's he'll be oh once per battle delayed delay the arrival incoming ra enemy reinforcements by one turn or fall back grant a free but uncontrolled defensive action to any visible ally who has used all their moves that's an interesting one um because it, it feels like um it feels like on top of command it's like oh you know you should uh the only problem with fall back is that it's uncontrolled so we don't know what's gonna it, it's like it's hard to say it's hard to like say whether our target will actually do anything where's jammer jammer is something we can definitely use in a when we're in a pinch so we should we should train that we should yep there we go he's back in training for eight days poor guy you know he's probably sure come out on the field the sometime results to be as intriguing as i do commander commander with the advent Thanks. officer currently in cold storage we should perform the autopsy as soon as possible indeed we got laser weapons. Uh, now I need to decide what research to do next. So we can definitely do the autopsy that will allow us to um, advance forward a bit more, or we could do advanced laser weapons. So I kind of really want to just go straight into advanced laser weapons, so we can build some more. So let's go build some laser weapons first. Just the word and I'll get started, Commander. Uh, we've got 30 supplies, That's which is, which is probably, like, we can only just build one. <laughs> Alright, so we'll get a laser rifle. Oh, we, we have one laser rifle already. Okay, that's great. Um, I, am ready to begin I don't... Your order, Commander. So, I think, uh, we'll go, we'll go for the... Radio uses supplies, so I don't, don't really want to spend that yet. So we'll go for the Advent Officer top The Advent Officers that's... appear to be similar, if not physically the same as the common Advent Trooper in terms of power and agility. However, field reports indicate a more developed mental acuity, as the officers do provide tactical directives to the subordinate Advent Forces. Oh, Tygen. <laughs> Okay, um, we've only got one scientist, which is I suppose is not really that much of an issue, but resistance comes to capacity, low intel. Low intel is 74? I mean, I don't quite agree, but who am I to complain 160? So, we definitely want to build a relay somewhere. Um, we need to research that first. So, hello. 3 days, 19 hours, so destroy the alien relay finally, so that's um, that's going to be like an advancement on the liberation mission, so 3 days, 19 hours really East Africa. That doesn't give us much, um, it really doesn't give us much time to actually going and do anything, so either we're going with a full, either we're going with a full squad, or we skip this mission, and since since we pretty much, you know, have like a whole bunch of decked out people that can pretty much do what we want, we may as, we may as well go with, with a relatively cool squad. So, if you excuse me, I have a squad to set up. 
All right, we've got a team of nine going in with two, uh, a second lieutenant and a first lieutenant, and two grenadiers, uh, two grenadiers, more importantly, because, you know, we're probably going to have a whole bunch of people, two technicals as well, because we're going to need the double rockers, and most people were fitted with the standard loadout. Of course, now we've got a couple of upgrades in that. Our Shinobi can wear the nut. We'll have our Shinobi wearing the nut scale vest because she, she's going to be one of the more aggressive Shinobis out there. And, of course, we've got Aoki equipped with our brand new laser weapon as well as our Grenadier as well, because our Grenadier actually has really, really good aim, so we will definitely take advantage of that as well. So, without further ado, let's send that team off. And we're going to need all, all the luck we have for that one. So I'm really looking forward to, I'm re really looking forward to that mission, and um, the, cause, um, cause the one of the more annoying parts is definitely destroying the alien relay, because it tends to have a lot of HP, so that's going to be a challenge. Alright, so 8 days, 18 hours, ambush and advent troop column, reduce enemy strength. Yes, please. We can definitely do that. Of course, um, our main aim now is to get a bunch of supplies so that we can, we can, we can essentially, you know, build more laser weapons, do our research, and then, um, it, it essentially get a step forward. So, if you excuse me, I have another team to make. Sigh. Okay, so we've got a team of six, you know, fairly reasonable equipped people. It's just kind of just like, um, not really much to say. Five days, two hours. I, I know I can definitely put more in, but it's one of those, well, you know, we probably won't need it. So we, we won't push it too much. Um, and uh, of course we've got Lexi and then, um, we don't have a Grenadier, but we've got Lexi. And, um, we've got enough, we've got enough frag grenades to have, to pretty much make it a while. The good thing is that we, we if we succeed in this mission, we get enemy, we get basically get enemy material, which basically means corpses and stuff, which which will be basically a good boost Avenger of income. Actually, speaking course. of income, I want to head back to the black market see if there's anything we can sell, so Market's that we can build more laser weapons. Viper, viper corpse, but we need that, um, and we kind of just need everything we have right now. So, looks like that's not really gonna happen. Um, suppressor. Yeah, I mean, I mean, we're getting a van suppressors, but I do would like laser sight. We don't really take advantage of that all that well, so I know it's probably not the best decisions, but um, I definitely want my laser weapons. So what's the armory? Commander. Sorry, no engineering your items. Um, actually I want to build some tracer rounds as well, that'll be really nice. Um, Sten Gun feels a similar well to the SMG. Um... The thing is, it's like, surprisingly, I probably don't use laser rifles all that much, it's more the Sten Guns. And possibly the piston, and... Yeah, I definitely use the Sten Guns a lot more, so... We noticed early we'll on that. that Avenger has a tendency to... Not now! Got aliens to kill. Okay, so what's happening over there? Join two four. Okay. All right, recover from wounds. Lots of things happening. Yeah, that's this is what I thought might happen. Twenty nine intel counters a dark event. Thirteen days, seven hours. Well, what? <laughs> Part of me again. I've got another squad to kill. now operational. Oh god, uh, okay, so we got an unstarmed engineer, so I'll get him to help clear out this debris. Alright, um, what I want to do is swap the people out at the havens. So, we want muscle hero, we're gonna put a ranger in there because, um, we have too many rangers right now. So, which one is better? 13 but 74, or 15 movement but 68. I, I want a ranger that can shoot, so Leah, you're going in there. The problem, the problem is we need Haven advisors right now because it's like some someone's been stealing our supplies. Curse them. Uh, what else do we have doubles off? So we got another ranger. So Esha, sixty-four. Okay, you, well, you're not going to be too useful right now. Okay, um, there's that mission. Let's get back to this one. Let's fill fill up our team again with a much more balanced group of people. Alright, well, that's the remainder of our group, so we may as well send them off and um, know that they will do well. So, I'm not going to be too worried, but of course we're now out of people to send on further missions, so... 
This one does, it's definitely a juggling thing in terms of... It's definitely a juggling thing in terms of intel because it's like, it's like here because I've got people on intel there might actually be missions that pop up so it's like I don't want that to happen because we're, we're not going to be able to deal with them anyway but it's like here you know we're, we're probably a bit more interested in kind of just like spreading our influence over there while we can so... Oh lordy. Uh, get advanced attention, neutralize target. We don't, we don't have a team for this. So, that's, that's really not going to... Yeah, we don't have a team, so we're going to have to ignore this one. Um, we'll just keep on scanning. So, we don't want to scan over there. Uh, uh we probably want to stay around. <sighs> decisions, decisions. Supply rate, are you kidding me? One day, uh, we, we, we can't, we, we can't, not worth it. Uh, view soldier, great, okay, well, what else can you... Okay, looks like I can't train anything else on you at the moment, so let's just... No, that's the Advanced Warfare Center, if you part of me. Richard, um, Gunslinger covering fire. Not really, not really all that great bunch of skills, but while you're the only one, you're the only one kind of just like not there at the moment. Um, we can at least do covering fire because it's, re it's reasonably, it's tangibly useful. You can also use it when you have suppression as well. Okay, so Operation Frost Sprints, this is the one with moderate heavy, 45 evac A. This is going to be very interesting or I might, might even skip this mission, but of course that's for me to find out and that's for you to wonder and just wait until I see what I do. So, as always, thank you for watching and I will see you on the next video on Operation Frost Prince.